Uh, I'm sure some of you felt like that game was in hand. I didn't. I I just Bybee like this kid. I do want to start off on the positive. I like Bybee a lot. Clearly, I think he's big time. I thought that was gutsy to have a second start in the in the Bronx and play that well. I thought he did such a nice job. So Bybee, I want to get out the positive. Naylor also grooved another RBI today. Cool to see. Okay, Karen check. Karen check shouldn't be in these games right now. He is not pitching well. And for him to be brought back out in the very next inning and he gives up a bomb to Calhoun, who hasn't had a home run ever, ugh, that's frustrating. Karen check's frustrating. That's frustrating. He just doesn't have it right now. That I hope Bybee's okay too. John Potter's team is weak. Just can't stay consistent. 11 strikeouts today. Way too many strikeouts. Anytime the guards get above seven or eight, it's usually a loss. They had 11 today. Now, some of that's Garrett Cole. Garrett Cole's very good. And Michael King is very good. And the Yankees played this like a playoff game. They've lost so many games in a row. They've lost four in a row. So the Yankees really won this win. So all that plays in, all this plays into it. But I don't understand Karen Chak, A, coming in that spot. I would not put him in that spot. I put Stefan in that spot. There's several other guys you could have gone to there. Stefan's one for sure. I'd put Stefan in there any time in that spot. But to bring out Karen Chak in that spot ugh, gives up the game tying run and then the eventual winning run. Ah, uh, B- I like Bybee a lot too, Tom, sir. Avon and uh, Viantendi. I have no faith that the starters go less than seven innings. I think he's going to be good, though. Why does Tito keep bringing Wild Thing? I don't know, OB11. There's a time and place for Karen Check. It's right, but it's not right now. Karen Check does not have it. And that Calhoun home run was uh, awful. He shouldn't be on the team. He should be on the team, Halloween Logan, but he can't be pitching in big spots on the road against the Yankees. That is, just doesn't make sense. <laughs> Should have taken Bybee out after his arm got hit. Cram, that's a fair point. I think they did the right thing by keeping him in if he wants to stay in there, but I understand what you're saying. Eli Morgan was getting lit up too. He has not gotten lit up all year, Emu. That's his first earned run he's given up all season. Actually, Eli Morgan's pitched pretty well so far this year. Um, we have we have to explore what we can get for Karen Check. I think Karen Check just needs time. He struggled last year too. Uh, Riley Hall Productions. Love Riley Hall Productions. Let's give it time. But he, but what I don't agree with is coming out in a game when the Guardians are up by a run in the in the Bronx. You're putting out Karen check. Didn't agree with that move. JK's got to go. Can't wait for him just to return this week. He's coming back for the Twin Series. There is no heart in Cleveland right now. Oh, Tomster. I don't know about that. But there was no heart for the Cavs. I love Tomster. Always picks up him. I get Tomster's a good fan. He always picks up what I'm saying. Eli has been good. Just unlucky tonight. I agree with you about that. Bybee uh, LB Browns caught a line drive right in the middle of his glove awkwardly. He kind of looked like he got hurt for a second, but gathered himself. Couldn't make the play at first. Really, after that play, he was never the same. But Bybee had a wonderful game again. Up until that point, he was really good. This team isn't going anywhere, says Tristan. I don't agree with that. Run support, need bats. Karen Shack, boy, Karen Shack, LB Browns. Just does not have it right now. And again, let's say you put you out in the sixth inning, which he did. Why would you go back to Karen Shack in the seventh? And a tie game. Doesn't make sense. Poor decision. Win the series tomorrow, Bieber. I'll be happy to agree with you. We had this game one. Agree with you there, too. You had Cole on the ropes in the third. You need to score more than two runs. I agree with you about that. Um, Jimenez's bunt was not very good in this game. I know what you're referencing there, Bicato. How the Cavs not fired Altman? Um, well, there's been a lot of discussion about Altman this week, Tomster. JB's not going anywhere. JB deserves a little time to grow. He did have some very frustrating moments that we talked about on this channel. But JB's going to get another chance to coach, which I think is fine. I, I, he hasn't done anything. To, he, look, just give JB one more season. He didn't do a great job. Let's see what happens. But Altman in this Kevin Love move is really starting to swirl. There's been a lot of banter about the Kevin Love situation this week. And there should be. He's playing for the Heat in the second round. We should have had him on our team. Send down Karen Check, start spreading the news. Oh, Don Flex, come on, Don. Come on, Donnie. You got to score more runs. Yes, got to get more hits. 10, 11 strikeouts. 
Fair point on Eli Morgan, but we saw last year. I think Eli Morgan, though, is going to be okay, um, Emo, in the long run. One bad outing doesn't mean anything. Again, he's pitched really well this year so far. Uh, Plesak needs a trip to AAA for sure. So does Karen Check possibly. Again, I think Karen Check just needs time. But again, even though I'm patient with Karen Check, I don't want him in a 2 1 game in the Bronx coming out. Stefan hasn't pitched this week. Let's play out Stefan. Let's go. Roll out. Let's roll out the big boys. Let's go. Karen Check was getting hype after he gave up the first run. Yeah, I agree with you. He is very fragile right now. He's definitely fragile right now. Um, Zup. Bicato, you needed to get more than two runs off. Cole, I agree with you about that, Bicato. Not disagreeing with that point. Guardians' buyouts right now are not connecting like they should. There's no question about it. But Garrett Cole is an ace. He almost won the Cy Young last year. You can't get too upset about these situations. Karen Check's an eighth inning guy. No, he's not right now. Lane Bro, he's not an eighth inning guy. Right now, he's more of like a mop up coming in when they're down and run. Karen Check's been giving up bombs. He's been deflating this team. And even when he gets out of innings, it's stressful. I don't want to see Karen Check right now for a little bit. Not in these situations. Pitching's improving. Just need the bats to come alive. I do agree with you about that. I say call up to Gavin Williams. There's been a lot of rumors about that today. By the way, David Fry in the house. Well, if JB says nothing will change and laugh my ass off waste of a season, fucking embarrassment for a franchise. Tristan, great to have you as always. Riley Hall Productions, the bottom of the fourth, bottom four of the lineup, needs to figure things out. They were actually doing really well a couple weeks ago, Riley Hall. Straw's gone cold that eventually you knew it was going to happen. So Nino, who did have a big hit um, in the Boston series, had the big walk last night, didn't get any hits. I understand Brennan, who I think got I think Brennan got really thrown off by not playing a lot lately. Um, they, Brennan needs more at-bats. So I understand what you're saying with the bottom lineup. I think the, the time clock is messing with Karen Check. LB Browns, I don't think there's any question the clock is bothering Karen Check a lot. Cavs are going to be trash next season. Tristan, happy holidays. Happy happy spring. I heard I think we're 1-12. Uh, says Riley Hall. David Fry, baby. Pitch clock is a joke, says OB11. I don't mind it, actually. Uh, Penn needs Hinch's back badly. He's coming back Friday. He was going to be back tonight, but they keep having rain delays with, with Columbus. Rosario Steele in the ninth. Does that actually count as stolen base? Uh, yes, I think it should, actually. Get rid of Karen Jack. <laughs> Real Derek is tired of him. Braden, man tooth five. LeBron should take a year off and go coach Ohio State with while Bronny plays. There you go. Big game tonight, LeBron versus Curry. Why not let David Fry get a chance to bat tonight? I think that's a fair question. He will get his chance to bat. Can't wait for Buckeyes football. Only hopes for us to win anything, says Tristan. I think the Buckeyes offense is going under a major rebuild right now. Doesn't mean they won't be ready for the season, but there's a lot. There's an offensive line changing, quarterback changing. I think there's a lot of changes going on with Ohio State football. I don't know about that. Straw got uh, pinched. Uh, got pinched at the plate. Yes, yeah, so OB eleven, but Straw's got to make those plays too. You know, there's been a, the Guardians weren't chatty last year. They were getting chatty about strikeouts. I'd rather see them swing the bat than get chatty with the umpire. Will you be watching any of the Lakers versus uh, Warriors tonight? Yes, I will. Rob Ranford doing anything he can to psych out Garrett Check. Obviously, an extraterrestrial. Great to see you. I've not seen you in a while. Has LeBron uh, son chosen a school yet? I don't know. I don't think so. Karen Jack for president, says Don Flex. We need Jimenez to break out. Yes, we do. Jimenez is the second best hitter in his club. Uh, Jimenez needs to break out. We're starting to see things from Naylor. Josh Bell's been solid for the last three weeks now. He's playing much better. J-Ram's J-Ram. He's a Yankee killer. Quan's doing his thing. Really need more production. Rosario's starting to come around. Jimenez, though, is, I do agree with what you're saying, Michael. Jimenez has not been hot this year yet. Love to see a little bit of Jimenez getting a little hot. Give this lineup a little more time, too. Um, I think coming home will help as well. And there you go. Guards had opportunities. Bybee looked good up until that line drive that hit his glove. I still thought he played really well today. I have no idea why Karen checks in those situations he was in tonight. Sadly, he gave up runs when oh, that Calhoun home run was a gut punch. Absolute gut punch. 
Eli Morgan gave up his first unearned run of the year. Need the warm weather to warm up the bats. Our bats are better than this. I agree with you, Michael. Cleveland Guardians sucks. I think they'll be better in time, though. I think these, I will say this. I think the Guardians are starting to, their signs are coming out of it. But playing Garrett Cole in that spot and a cold night, it's, it's cold in New York. Uh, not not the best thing for the Guardians. But those are excuses, and you still got to win the games. And the Guardians right now just can't, can't, can't string together enough. Uh, we'll be watching LeBron tonight, absolutely. Yes. That's it. See you all tomorrow for more Guardians and Yanks.